Epic Owl Girl 1129 was here, November 5th, 2015. Memories. Oh my goodness. It's odd enough the pig. Ah. Yes, I fell. Why are there horses in the floor? It's Epic Algar here and welcome back to my channel and today I have rediscovered an old world in Minecraft that I spent so long on and it is absolutely the coolest world that I think I've ever made and it is like a Pokemon quest themed world like literally there are cool badges and things there are gyms and I made different like cities and towns and stuff and this is what we are going to be doing today. Um, I'm going to be looking around trying to go on a Pokemon quest and basically just going over this world because it is awesome and I totally forgot about it. So before we get started, make sure that you give this video a big thumbs up down below and also subscribe to join the hashtag Epic Alfam. And all right, you guys, I am in survival mode now. And let's read these signs. Okay, enter here uh, to Charizard Court slash bin Binacle Boulevard. Oh my gosh, I named all these after Pokemon. I remember building these. This was awesome. Oh my gosh. Uh, exit. Take five Poke Coins. Oof. Am I supposed to step on something? No. Okay, I got some Poke Coins. How is this supposed to help me? I don't know. But I have an Elytra. Uh, Audito. I'm gonna spawn in Audino. Oh my gosh. After you get your Pokemon, go someplace to build your house. Oh, I remember. I was gonna make an Audino. Oh my goodness. It's Audino the pig. Ah. Okay, we are going to go on here. We're gonna take the little minecart over to Charizard Court. Oh no, because I have so many commands in this world. It's probably so laggy right now. Memories. Okay, so yeah, I think all of these. Oof, I felt welcome to Dignit Diglett Valley. This in Honolulu. I think that was a. I think that's the name of the city or whatever. Uh, this is where your Pokemon journey begins. And if you wish to travel to another region or city, visit the train station. But this is the first town built on this map, so it is the best. I remember building this. It was probably 2015, actually. Hint, look for tips to help you through your journey. Alrighty, 227 Charizard Court. This used to be, uh, no, this didn't used to be my house. I think this one used to be my house. Okay, for sale, uh -huh. Below, owned by person who buys 228 Charizard Court. Who are you? All right, let's go and check out this house. This used to be my house, but let's check it out. Oh, pro tip, if you guys don't want your house to burn down with fire, just put a torch and then a piece of glass right here, and it'll look like a mini fire, and you won't burn your house down. That's a pro tip from Epic Owl TV. Alright, no, dude, why are you, uh, oh. well, I guess it's the villager's house now. Alright. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna go over here. This is Waylord Way. Oh my goodness, memories. And then the Diglett, ah, it's so cute. Alrighty, this is Epic Parkour Man's house. I got it first. Owned by Epic Parkour Man 1. All right, uh, these are the mail. All right, let's go in here. Why are there horses? Oh, cause I had a command that made horses into like um, into chairs, but then the command crashed, so now there are horses stuck in the floor. <laughs> oh, I love this house. And then it has these cool spinning things. I love them. Alright, let's see what's in here. Book and Quill. Pokemon Connoisseur. Oh yeah, he used to be a Pokemon Connoisseur. That was so fun. Okay, over here. This was like private, yeah, private property. 
I loved making this. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh yeah, that was to close it off so that nobody could get in. But then you go like this. And now you can get in. I was gonna build more houses here, but I never got a chance to. This this was going to be some sort of fancy gate thing. There you go. Whoosh. Oh wait. Oh, oh never mind. It has to be turned on. From okay. So how I did it is that if you're on the inside, then you can just go like that, and then I could go off. And then once you're on the in, and then you go to the outside and then you close it, and then you can go from the outside and open it, and then go to the inside and close it, and things like that. I also did a garage, I think, on this one. Yes. Yeah. Open and close. Oh my gosh, I love it. All right. This was actually a finished one. Lapras Lake. Ooh, house. <laughs> you have patio and lake access. I was gonna make this like some sort of server or something eventually, but I never did. Which was really sad. Uh, well, I can't get in here, but there is a bedroom in there. Nice little bedroom. Nice table with a plant. Nice fireplace. Do not put regal fire in. House will burn down. And then down here is just another cool thing. Wait, that's cool how I put the water in the window. Yeah, and there's just some bookcases, and that is it. All right, well, let's go and begin our Pokemon journey because it has been a while just looking at houses. And yeah, let's just start looking at these. All right, so now I think it is time that we should begin our Pokemon journey. Let's go down here to these shops. Oh my gosh, I used to be obsessed with making these shops. They are the coolest thing ever. Oh no, I closed it for renovation. What? Oh yeah, this was the Pokey Home Store. Okay. Um, so in here, there are more furniture and stuff, but then when the commands crashed, it kind of took the whole store with it. So I guess I closed that one down, which was really sad because there were three levels of awesomeness. But now we have the Pokey Shop. We got like beds and necessities, Pokeballs on sale. Is that another auto? No, I swear. Nope, it isn't. <laughs> Oh my gosh, and then I had a fan. A fan of all the Pokemon. Oh, that's so cute. All right, apparently those fans didn't crash. That's good. I made a cute Pokemon banner. All right, this one is the train station. So we're gonna go here after so we can look at some more cities. But then I think this one is Meloetta Music Store. I used to love Meloetta. That was my favorite Pokemon. It's like the music one. I'll insert a picture right here. Boop. All right, um, there's just some note blocks, things like that. Oh yeah, I used to have a working drum kit command or whatever, and then it broke. <laughs> so, unknown. Oh, unknown is the Pokemon unknown quote banners, and then you would go like this, and you would get some banners. Oh my gosh, I had so much fun making those. Alrighty, I think this one that was gonna go somewhere, but it doesn't apparently. I need to go and check out this gym up here because I remember I made an awesome gym and I never played in it once. <laughs> so let's go and check that out. I know I don't have any Pokemon because I think all the mods crashed, but that's okay. <laughs> let's just check this out. This is kind of like a world tour almost, but Dig Diglett statue, quote, he helped form the, ba the valley we know as home. Yep, so true. <laughs> uh, all right. Tip glowing beacon symbolize gems. <gasps> I made a beacon. Oh yes, and it's turning dark out, and then we can see the beautiful view. Oh my gosh, we need to go up here before it gets dark. I'm so sorry that this world is so laggy, you guys. Though. Oh, I think this was a rock type gem. You could get lost. Uh, yes, rock and steel type gem. If you come watch it, I'll proceed up, up the stairs on the right. Sorry. Oh. Okay, so let's first pretend that we are going to watch it. Stairs for viewing platform level C, and then we went up here, and then you go, whoa, we can watch it. All right, go ahead. If you want to go to the B, oh, wait, where is it? Yeah, right here. So more seating. Oh, yeah, levels A. Oh, yeah, so A was like the fancy seating, where you get to go up close right there. And then B was right in here, and then there's like some seating, seating. Okay, but right here is when you would go in here, I think, to watch. No, down here you go if you're going to battle the gym leader. All right, so these are all... Albert Sanchez, the gym leader, in memory of the oldest gym leader and legend. All right, so I think those are all of his badges. Wait, what? I? Oh, that's okay. These used to be seats too, but now there's a flower on the front head. All right, please take a number that will be the order for you to battle. And then you would go in here, aw. All right, and I think this is how you get out, if I'm not mistaken. You go like this, and then some things light up or whatever, and then you go up here, and then you go whoosh, and then you get a pocket card. All right, I'm gonna get some of those. Thank you for coming to battle with us. All right, perfect. And now that it is nighttime, oh my goodness, this is the coolest view 
literally ever. Whoa. I don't even remember this awesome view. Oh my gosh, there's the beacon. Okay, that was awesome. All right, but I think that there was an Easter egg in here. If you go up here, I remember building something on the top, but I think I need to get into creative to do that. All right, I know you seek riches. Oh my gosh, this was 2015. Epic Owl Girl 1129 was here, November 5th, 2015. Oh my goodness, oh, memories. And I got a diamond, yeah. Actually, All right, you guys, so now we are approaching the train station, and I love how it's all blue. Oh my gosh. A right, train station. All right, let's see. Schedule, Terminal 1. Where does that go? University? I don't remember which one I need to go to. Terminal 3, Coscaro City, uh, Merrigan City. Oh my goodness. I don't even remember which one goes where, but apparently there's only two. This is a long ride. Go. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna look down so that hopefully it goes faster because if I look up and it's super laggy. And for some reason when I look down, it's not that laggy. So I'll see you guys when we get closer to the city. We are so close, but I see a sheet. So you know, that's pretty good. And an airplane. I made these really cool airplane things that I should probably look up how to make again, but yeah, pretty much. All right, let's go, you're so close. Unova, I think it said. I don't know. But here we go. Just some uh, carrots. I'll take some of those. Carrots. What? Are you serious? I could have got... Mm. Alright. Let's go. Let's walk down here. See, this looks a little bit more, more modern. Is this the only thing here? Ugh. Well, it's an Apple store. Great. Always love a good Apple store. <laughs> All right, so we got some iPads, it looks like, some nice new computers, and another computer. Nice Apple logo, though. I remember I made this from a tutorial. I was like, haha, I gotta make an Apple store. But I think that that is actually about it for this video, you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, then give it a big thumbs up, and I hope you guys liked seeing all of my old worlds. This is actually, this is from 2015. That is crazy, it is now 2018, for reference. Three years later, I'm back in this world for the first time playing it through, and I really like it. So if you guys want me to go back and test out in some more of my worlds, then make sure to leave that in the comments down below, or just give this video your thumbs. Give it a big thumbs up so that I know that, that you guys enjoy it, and then I'll make more of these. And maybe I'll update a little bit more before I play some other ones again too because I have a lot of fun worlds that I want to show you guys. So that is it. I'll see you guys next week because I post every single Wednesday if you guys didn't know. And also subscribe to join the hashtag EpicAlfam. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye!